Yeah, Dubin called for the offensive foul as he turned around. Now, this is a desperate uh, measure now on the part of Coach Joseph Vichigo. I think Olsen Rosalo was saying that he got hit on the face. Desperate measure meaning, I think this is a rare situation where Hinebra is playing three guards. And that's, that's a situation that they, that they like to, to, uh, to have. Hold on. Oh, and, That's a uh, problem here in the court. Yeah, there seems to be an exchange here. Well, also, Nacella definitely did not like the contact. Yeah. As Ronald Tubi turned around, there it is, right, yeah, in the, right, there. right in the face. An yeah. elbow to the face of Olsen and Nacella. Now, Tubi and Olsen and Nacella look like they're challenging each other. No. No, they're not challenging each other. I think Tubi is saying sorry. But I think Rosella has a has a mouse now, a and Tubid raises his hand. Yeah, well, Ronald Tubid, he, he, he said sorry. It's a physical game. Yep. But you see, you see the bruise now, on, right there in the face of Olsen Rosella. He got smacked. Now, Ronald Tubid has conceded and, uh, and and he's accepted it. And uh, here's a look at it. There's a the left elbow coming down hard on Olsen Rosella's face. And you see here, actually, uh, and actually after that play, you'll see Ronald Tubit sort of land a little bit also on the foot yeah. of uh, Olsen Rosella. But uh, you, know, you don't want this happening with the game 146 away from uh, from ending, and that's a that's a nasty bruise. Right, <laughs> you're right about that. Oh, and Olsen Rosella with his best response to everything that just happened here, scoring a basket, adding insult to injury. Bruce and all, and look at the way he's playing defense on Chico Lanete. And forcing the turnover. Yes. Well, uh, that's because of the disruption. Uh, he's sending a message. Wesley Gonzalez now coming in. So Gabe Freeman, who played this uh, entire fourth quarter with five personal.